preparing uh, for eventual human missions to Mars. So this is one step along the way of our journey to accomplish that goal. Do you want the future where we become a space-faring civilization and are in many worlds and are out there among the stars or one where we are forever confined to Earth? And I say it is the first. We're looking on a full-scale version of MOXIE of making about 30 tons, 30 metric tons of oxygen. This is a, you know, one to 200 scale prototype. Soyong 원자로, 그러니까 원자력 전지라고 부르는데요. 이 원자력 전지로 발전을 해서 전력을 공급하는 방안을 생각하고 있습니다. Not only would it be horrendously expensive and complex from the point of view of coordinating all the different launches, it would probably put a human Mars mission off by 15 or 20 years, I would bet.
chemical resources, uh, the material resources, the rock, you know, the soil, the ground, things you can make into bricks, uh, anything you can transform into a useful, a useful form. Once 생명체가 발견됐다고 하면은 우리한테 유익하느냐 아니면 유해하느냐 방역 차원에서 굉장히 신중해야 하리라 생각합니다. We're, we're faced with a choice. Which future do you want? Do you want the future where we become a space-bearing civilization and are in many worlds and are out there among the stars or one where we are forever confined to Earth? And I say it is the first. And, and, and I hope you agree with me. Yeah. Thank you.